Hey guys, uh, thanks so much for watching. Um, I just completed week four of Weight Watchers and I lost one pound. So at this point I'm down uh, 13 pounds, which is great. And I'm really going to try to crack down in the next week and, um, well, I'm already in my fifth week, but I'm really going to try and I have been trying to crack down and just eat less bad stuff because part of this diet is that you can eat bad stuff, which is like very tempting. So I'm still doing good and I'm still losing weight. Um, however, I'm going to LA next week for IMATS, which is, uh, for those of you who don't know that I'm a makeup artist, it's a huge makeup convention where I get to meet some of the people who view my stuff and also buy like all kinds of makeup. And, um, I think the real definitive moment in deciding that I needed to lose weight was last year for IMATS, taking pictures with all of these uh, viewers of my videos, and then they posted on my Facebook, and I realized, oh my god, I'm huge. So, um, I'd like to lose like three pounds in a week, and I think that I can do it if I just eat the things that are zero points, like fruits and vegetables. Um, another thing that's super helpful is that uh, butter is a lot of points, but you can use the spray, like I can't believe it's not butter and it's zero points. So that's really good. At the gym I started weight training, um, that's been going good. I just do three reps of 10 on like several different machines. I'm trying to work out my arms. I'm really not touching my legs because my legs are so jacked like naturally. I have really big thigh muscles and calf muscles. So I'm still walking an hour a day and I don't want that muscle to get like super big. So I really don't do any leg exercises. I do arm and I work out my stomach. Uh, yeah, all of those things. So it's going really good and uh, I'm enjoying myself and things are starting to fit again that weren't. It's a joy to be able to cross my legs again, like the little things in life that you maybe don't realize that you're lacking until BAM you lose a ton of weight. And there's an awesome open amount of communication on Twitter that I really enjoy. Uh, people posting me what their weaknesses are and me posting what my weaknesses are and we all kind of communicate and we're like, listen, this is what I do to get around that or, you know, this is how my day is going as far as this weight loss journey is going. So I really do encourage you guys to um, follow me on Twitter what a blessing it is to hear so many people saying that they were motivated to join Weight Watchers or just lose weight on their own. Um, it's really wonderful. It makes me thrilled to have this little platform that I have and I can share my struggle with you guys. And turns out that there's thousands of you out there who struggle with the same thing. So next week is really going to be a challenge. Like I said, I'm going to be in LA and it's like, oh, I'm on vacation. Yay. I'll just eat whatever I want to eat. And it's like, no. So, um, I was saying on Twitter today that if you guys meet me at IMATS, make sure that you remind me that I have to stay on track with eating right. Just because I'm on vacation doesn't mean that I can eat everything in sight. It will be very, very trying. And, um, I think I could do it though. I'm, I'm at the point where I've gotten used to and I enjoy eating healthier and less. So um, I've come too far at this point to mess it up by going on vacation and eating a bunch of fried shit, which is totally my weakness. So yeah, wish me well. And I think that's all I have to say about week four. There will be a tutorial for this look and I'll post it somewhere in here. I'm sure it's up there already by now. Yeah, thanks for watching and I'll see you right back here for next week's Weigh in. Okay. Bye.